And we're back everyone to my Let's Play video series of Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Now then, yeah, I just have to go to the Atlas View of Danecrest, so let's go. And down the stairs. Yeah, that's where it says to go, I guess. Okay. Adjust my headset once more. Yeah, I think it's like painful at times. If it's. Ugh. Freaking side jabbing into my ear, but oh well. I should be good for now. Hopefully. I know if I didn't screw up the sound on this, but oh well. Touch my carrier. You, hey, what can I say? You preserved my ass. I truly appreciate you not saying anything, and I want you to know I take care of those who do me favors. So from now on, you need equipment, info, you come see me at my apartment. Don't hesitate. Yay. What are you doing out here, Mikael? I just wanted to make sure you knew my appreciation. And like I said before, if someone needs something, I can get it. It's Bo, for example. I might need some equipment for this little trip. And all he has is crossbow bolts. And so I adjust the mic again. And I might have to quit soon. Thing is getting a tad painful than I appreciate. Ah, but oh well. And then let's see. Basically, down the turn over sell that the buy back for prob practically more than that but at least it gets ammo on those suggestions Talk you to might her. save me but I can't look at you to think anyone could be so compassionate okay whatever she's pissed off at me for I still don't know why but oh well Onward to the Elizabeth Dane. And up this ladder. Yo, Pat, oh, for Christ's sakes. Tell Jacobson if he plans on making editor in chief, he's got to start working with me. I can't keep getting him these scoops if he's going to send high school journalists who don't know enough to wear something that would blend in. Uh, he didn't tell me this was a far more fail. Jeez. What kind of wood steam? Don't think to at least show dressed up like an investigator, a Coast Guard guy, something. Didn't you ever see Fletch? Were they just handing out those diplomas nowadays? Eh, enough. We need to do this fast if we don't do it. All right, look. I got you a copy of the initial report, and I can get you into the cabin, but you gotta make yourself real scarce after that. Anybody catches you, I don't know you. And no goddamn flash photography, brainchild. Where do I go? Hold up a sec. Heinz to Marsh. Heinz to Marsh. Marsh, they need you up in the bridge. Over. There. The security room will be clear. Uh. God. Head down the stairs behind you and stay low. When you get down there, wait for me to call off the guy guarding gangway A. As soon as he leaves, get your ass moving and don't let him see you. I'll give you a couple of minutes, but don't dilly-dally. In and out, okay? I understand. Don't forget to stay out of sight. If anyone sees you, you're on your own. Take the stairs up to the security room. There'll be a computer in there. The password is Lighthouse. Lighthouse. All one word. You getting all this? Yep, got Now get a move on. And don't forget to tell Jacobson I get double my usual fee for this one. Uh, okay. Whoever Jacobson is, I don't know. Heinz to Jacobson. Uh, Anderson. Heinz to Anderson. Come in, Anderson. <laughs> Come check this out. I just saw a baleen whale. Yeah? Um. Is he gonna move? That's better. I guess that's blood or water. I can't tell. What's blood like? 
Now there's one light too. So I have to sneak. A for sneaking. And then it's just guards over there. So in this door here. Close behind me. Records room. Lock picking. Open. Ah, the ship manifest. Need that. Seemed very worried about the safety of this sarcophagus and various other offense from his dead, but I assured him that all was well. 10.14.04. Rough waters last evening. Operations normal, but the crew seems restless. One of the turrets has been telling them ghost stories. I had Lute and Stike and take him aside and speak with him. Nothing to report, situation normal. Two of the crew have gone missing, and I fear they may have fallen overboard sometime during the night. No trace of Eva, Lieutenant Stike, and. No trace of Eva. Lieutenant Stike has tried to contact their families, but something seems to have gone wrong with the radio. We may have a saboteur on board. The great hole in the sarcophagus seems to have been opened. We have found blood on the upper and lower decks, and it seems that at least three more of the crew are missing. The men are hysterical. I found the Turk in his cabin curled up into a ball, muttering something indecipherable to himself. Lieutenant Stiking is one of the missing crew, as well as the radio technician. One of the men had a short wave radio, but all calls for help have gone unanswered. I leave this to whoever may find it. This ship is cursed. May it sink to the crushing depths of Davy Jones' locker before the had a bloody luck. Whatever happened. Control. Lighthouse. Hey. Uh. Deck. Camps. On. Hey, sound on. Hey, start engines. That's nice. Anyway, look at this. Yeah, we may seen the crime scene. But oh well. Now then, let's walk away, Alfil. Should be too bad to get Alfil, I hope not. Anyway. Oh crap, this way's blocked off. Shh, that's not good. Okay, I'll go this way then. Can't go that way either. Okay, that way. This way. Ah, move. I get myself confused. Okay, this is what I was thinking. Oh, sneaky, sneaky, because the prince doesn't want me to kill everyone. How nice. There we sneak. Hop. And we're out of hell. Wasn't that fun, everyone? Now we have to get back to the prince and tell him about this. Um. 
Okay. Hope you all enjoying this. Thank you all and have a nice day.